Hello students, in the present video we will understand the financial accounting introduction, definitions, objectives and functions. When you come to the introduction part, here as you are already aware, accounting is always refers to as the language of business. The basic function of any language is to serve as a means of communication and accounting also serves this function. It communicates the results of business operations to various parties who have some stake or interest in the business like the proprietor, creditor, investors, government and other government agencies. Though accounting is generally associated with business but it is not only business which makes use of accounting. Persons like homemakers, housewives, government and other individuals also make use of accounting information. So I hope you understood what is accounting here. Right? So now we will understand the definitions of accounting. When you come to the definitions, According to the American Institute of Certified Public Accountants, the art of recording, classifying, summarizing, analyzing and interpreting the business transactions systematically and communicating the business results to interested users in is accounting. Right? So this definition says that it is refers to as recording, classifying, summarizing, analyzing and interpreting the financial data which is needed by the business entities and communicating the same information to the interested parties in the business organization. Already we have discussed in the earlier slide the who are the interested parties such as proprietor, creditors, government and general public even. When you come to the second definition, according to American Accounting Association, it is the process of identifying, measuring, recording, communicating the required information related to the economic events of an organization to the interested users of such information. So the same, both the definitions are giving us the same meaning that we are communicating information to the needed and interested parties in the information right so with the help of these two definitions we understood that it is recording classifying summarizing and interpretation is very significant and communicating the information to the interested parties uh, now we will understand the objectives of financial accounting when you come to the objectives of financial accounting, the first one is finding out various balances. So here, as an accounting uh, person, we must find the balances of various ledgers, various accounts. What is the quantity of stock lies with the organization and what is the value of that stock? What is the amount receivable from the debtors? What is the amount payable to creditor? What is the capital introduced or invested by the proprietor? So all these balances we need to ascertain as a part of the accounting information. So this is considered as one of the most important objectives of accounting. The next one is providing knowledge of transactions. In the sense whatever transactions that are taking place in the organization pertaining to accounting which is having economic value or monetary value, those transactions must be recorded and kept in the books of accounts and whenever we want that information can be used for further interpretation and analysis and for communication. So knowledge of transactions is quite significant in accounting. Ascertaining the net profit or loss. As you are already aware, every business will be started with an intention to earn certain amount of profit. So earning profit is the primary object of every business organization. Therefore, it is significant that the accounting should communicate the information whether the business is earning profit or incurring the loss. 
if it is earning profit it will be continued if it is incurred loss if it is incurring loss or losses it will be closed depicting financial position so accounting will also provide the information of the financial position of the business organization where the business organization standing what is the financial position what are the assets what are the liabilities that business is having what is the financial position which is very significant data and information for the users information to all interested stakeholders or users as we have already discussed this item that the accounting will communicate all the required and significant and material information to the users fulfilling legal obligations certain cases of the business organization like companies and all the accounting is a legal requirement the government and other enforcement agencies or other government authorities will ask for accounting information especially income tax department to calculate to assess the value of tax payable by the business so this will also fulfill the purpose of legal obligations next is functions of financial accounting one of the most important functions of financial accounting is maintaining systematic records so maintenance of record is most significant all the financial data all the accounting information or any information which is having monetary value should must be recorded should must be maintained systematically uh, the reason for maintaining is whenever the users require this information for making decisions it should be readily available for making decisions communicating the financial results of course uh, the basic function of accounting is to communicate the results of the organization that is business organization whether the business is earning profits or incurring losses meeting the legal requirement the same thing what we have discussed the function is to meet the legal requirements of accounting as it is provided by or enforced by the government authorities fixing responsibilities accounting will also fix the responsibility of various levels of authority in the hierarchy of the organization whether the data is provided properly or not it will create the responsibility among the authority of the organization decision making very significant is decision making all these things we are doing for the purpose of making prudent decisions only because managers make decisions for making decisions they require information so accounting will provide information for making such decisions thank you very much for watching the video i wish you all the best do subscribe my channel and motivate me to make more qualitative informative videos other videos pertaining to accounting uh, journal ledger trial balance final accounts are already been made and link pertaining to that i will be sharing in the i button as well as in the description box all the best wish you success thank you very much